Alabama has rather unusual ways of weighing things in drug trafficking cases. In other words, it's not what you commonly would think of with your regular math. Let me explain. Let's say we have a friend, and his name is Hard Luck Harry. Hard Luck Harry goes to his dealer and he says, Hey, dealer, sell me some cocaine. I want to buy 20 ounces of cocaine. Well, dealer says, Look, it's prepackaged. I only have it in 30 ounce containers. Tell you what, since you're a good customer, I'll sell you 30 ounces for the price I normally sell for 20. Just give me that. Great. He does it. Well, what Hard Luck Harry doesn't know is that his dealer has cut that cocaine. And what he's really bought is 28 ounces of baking soda with two ounces of cocaine. So he really only got two ounces of cocaine. He also doesn't know that his dealer was working as an informant. And the dealer calls the cops and says, hey, this guy just bought some. You might want to make a bust. Cops come. They bust hard luck Harry. Harry finds himself in court, and he is charged with trafficking. He's charged with trafficking because of the weight of the cocaine. Harry says, wait, wait, wait a second. I only had two ounces. That's a lot of for trafficking cocaine. How do you get that? Well, you get that because Alabama does math the way Jethro from the Beverly Hillbillies did math, with, or even writing arithmetic with an R. It doesn't do arithmetic. Alabama math is that if you have any drugs in a mixture and you can't separate the mixture, you count the whole thing. So poor hard luck Harry, even though he only got two ounces of actual cocaine and 28 ounces of baking soda, he's charged with 30 ounces of cocaine that's enough to get him 10 to life in prison. So Alabama has a peculiar way of weighing things when it comes to drug trafficking cases. Now, if the mixture is separable, then it wouldn't have counted. So let's say we have a, another druggy guy named Lucky Larry. And Larry says, you know what, I'm going to get some cocaine. And he goes to his dealer and says, look, I want some crack rocks. I want, I'd like to buy a trafficking amount. Whatever, I want to buy 30 ounces of crack. Drug dealer rips him off and he gives him, he, he shows him uh, two ounces of, of, of real crack and he throws that in the bag and in the bag he's put bars of soap or soap, cracked up bars of soap, crushed so it looks like cocaine to him. He's arrested. Larry's arrested but isn't charged with trafficking because, well, it's easily separable. He's just charged with possession of cocaine. I hope you find these videos to be educational and informative. And of course, if you find yourself in a legal jam, you need a lawyer. If you want to talk to us, we're happy to help you. Our phone number and contact information is below. Thanks for watching the video.